Well, so I just, um, I currently have my fourth session, but I wanted to learn a little bit more about Aplink yeah. and what kind of benefits that has versus my fourth touch. So, uh, Aplink is a product uh, on sync um, that allows you to connect your mobile apps in your vehicle to the car. And so, I'm sure you have a bunch of mobile apps that, that you use. Do you have an iPhone or an yes, Android? I have an iPhone. So you have an iPhone. And is there any apps on there that you, that you use on a regular basis, like music apps? Pandora. Pandora. Yeah. So, great. Uh, Pandora is just one of the dozens of apps that we have available that are AppLink capable. Okay. And what that does is, when you get stuff into your car, you connect your phone. So, at that point, you can go and launch it through the car's infotainment system, okay. the same. whether you want to do it through uh, the menu or via voice, you can say Pandora, it'll launch the app. At that point, your music's playing in your car, you can see the metadata, you can skip uh, different playlists and so forth, you press the button on your steering wheel control, it'll ask you what you want to do, and you say play playlist, uh, party mix, or whatever it is, and it'll, okay. it'll load it up. You don't even have to touch your phone at that point. So it's all voice commands, pretty much. Voice commands, but also button, um, okay. whatever the user is comfortable with. You know, you just uh, uh, you can use interchange them. Um, but yeah, it's it's the experience that you have with your ass uh, brought into the vehicle in a safe way. So your hands are on the wheel, your eyes are on the road, okay. but uh, you're you're listening to some great content. What other um, apps are there besides Pandora? What else could you do? So in addition to Pandora, yes, we do have a lot of different uh, music streaming apps. Okay. Um, but we do have uh, news apps, so things like Stitcher, NPR News, USA Today. Um, we just announced a bunch of new apps like USA okay. Today. Uh, we have navigation apps. We have point of interest apps. Uh, okay. Apps like Proximity, where you could be driving down the road and it'll say, "Hey, there's a. Uh, I know you like pizza. There's a uh, deal at this one pizza parlor. You know, a couple blocks down on the right. Oh, okay. Uh, half off or something. So like kind that. of like a Foursquare Yelp check-in through your car. Exactly. Okay. So and. The uh, great announcement that we had yesterday is that we're opening up the uh, developer network. And okay. what that is, is now anybody can, who's a mobile app developer can go to the site to developer.ford.com okay. and download our SDK and our, our, our code and basically start writing app one gaps or taking their existing app and putting our code in there so we can talk to the Oh, that's app. awesome. Yeah, so we're, we're looking to see all sorts of cool new creative apps that are, that are up Kind of like the same thing Apple does, like Apple developers. Exactly. Okay. The same apps, but just a little bit extra code. To, to make it work with the system. To talk to the car and say, perfect. Yep.